Thank you, Tom. Well, the Purple Tutu is an organization that brings the beauty and artistry of ballet to dancers with Down syndrome. Holland McDowell is the founder of this amazing organization and joins us now with some information on upcoming camps and how our viewers can get their little princesses all signed up and in the tutu. Holland, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for having me. Now, this is going to be your second summer workshop that's going to be coming up, but tell us why this particular project is so near and dear to you and why you started it well I've been doing dance for almost nine years and I dance has affected me so much it's brought me out of my shell I'm not as shy anymore and I feel like it can really help these children with Down syndrome especially because they have they have lack of core strength but they have amazing flexibility so that corresponds really well with ballet awesome and so what's the um, I asked you earlier there's a reason actually behind the color purple when yes. it comes to your organization tell us about that well, stereotypically, ballet is um, with pink, mm -hmm. and we are a very special organization, and I felt purple was yeah. um, with children, but also very special. Now, what have you found, uh, because this is your second workshop that's going to be coming up, those who have participated, what ages are we talking about? From four, four to 15. Okay, now what's been their experience with the whole thing? I'm sure it's been very very fun, a little different, and it, you know, it gives them a chance because when you're, you think of ballerinas, you think of very dainty and mm -hmm. uh, very poised. What's been their experience with it? They love it. They've really got a chance, chance to shine, and it's amazing. They've really grown. And do you find that some of them actually have become interested in dance and performing? Yes. Wow, yes. we're looking at some pictures right now. What do you do? What's going on right there? Here Can we are talk? helping oh, showing them how to point their feet. toes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Now, the summer workshop, when is the, that going to be starting? It's pretty soon. Yes, it starts next week. It's two weeks. It's July 29th and August 5th, those two weeks. Mm -hmm. And it's in the morning. Four, ages 4 to 10 is from 9 to 9.50 in the morning. Mm -hmm. And ages 11 to 15 is from 10 to 10.50 in the morning. Now, are you asking that folks kind of pre-register, or do they just yes. show up to Mount Pleasant Presbyterian Church? To register, I would like them to email me at thepurple22ballet at gmail.com so mm -hmm. I can yeah. get them registered. Yes. Now, once again, uh, with working with uh, children who have Down syndrome, why did you uh, choose to pick that, that particular, um, particular area? Well, I did learn that they have amazing flexibility, which is perfect for ballet, where flexibility is much needed. Mm -hmm. And they, ba they also lack core strength, which ballet provides. And also corresponds with me, since I have a little trouble with my flexibility, but mm -hmm. I'm strong in core, so yeah. I can help them and they can help me. Yeah, because you've, you've been dancing relatively, well, nine years. Yes. I can't say how old you are, and I don't know, and I won't try to attempt, but you still look very young, but most kids, you know, they start at a very, very young age, and then, you know, they, they dance for 10, 15 years or so, but you're kind of relatively new, would you say, just only dancing for nine years, or are you that young? <laughs> I'm thinking. Yeah? Yes, mm -hmm. I'm relatively new. No, relatively new, but you mm -hmm. love it. Yes, And like I you love said, it. it has brought you out of your shell. Yes. Do you find that the kids that you work with, they have a tendency to be a little shy and withdrawn? Yes, definitely. We had this one girl who would not get out of her father's lap, but after only about two classes or two days, mm -hmm. she had fully come out. She was dancing by herself and was loving it and enjoying every minute. Awesome. And so do you guys do like a recital at the end of it, or...? We try to, but... We encourage the parents to come watch on the last class to okay. observe. But and just to see how far their child has come. But I think that's perfect when you see some of the dance instructors there. I'm sure you have great uh, dancers that are assisting in this yes. as well and volunteering. Our assistants are amazing. They have been doing ballet for almost as long as I have. And awesome. Yes. I will. All right, so for more information on it, where can they go? To our Facebook page, which is the Purple Tutu Ballet. You can like our Facebook page or you can email me for any questions you have. Yeah. The Purple Tutu Ballet at gmail.com. And I think it's a great cause, a great organization, Holland. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me. You are welcome. Well, stay with us. We're back.